it, I would say. Um, I have already said to people out there that, look, it really does, if you're not successful, the process hones your intentions. It causes you to stop and assess what you've been doing, where you're going. It makes you question whether and how serious you are about your endeavour. And I think that in itself is valuable. I found the, the interview process and the experience supportive, um, unlike, I guess, some sort of more standard applications where you're a number. Uh, this is very personal. It's very focused. And um, so the process itself is really enjoyable. I've met some great people. Um, and I feel like it's got it itself, the Institute has a great vision for Australia and the idea of upskilling our own country, finding out gaps, finding out amazing trades and things that we half of us don't really realise are career based. I think I was encouraged too because of the young, the younger generation um, looking at creating opportunity um, and what sort of jobs are out there and things like you know knife making and um, understanding old style locks and rocking horses to open up a sense of career-based vision is exciting and being able to tap into that is great. As a future fellow, it gives you, I guess it gives you a, a sense of being able to be an ambassador for things too. And I think you get a lot of self a pride to not just be about you, but to be able to connect to others and, so, and have an us sense of Australia as well. And when you're traveling overseas to be representative of your own space your own country and your own area is it's it's building of the self i mean that's soul food in itself and i i'd encourage it and whether or not you're successful at it i don't think it matters because personally i knew that if i didn't get chosen as a fellow i had really gained a lot of, of stopping from you know just doing the farm jobs and saying okay let me focus on this because i've had the ideas out there while we you know harvesting and carrying buckets and doing our jobs thinking wishing and then someone believes in you and can make it happen. If they don't, the supportive process doesn't let you down. You don't feel like you weren't good enough. I think it's, um, they've already gifted you something. It's the opportunity to believe in yourself. So I'd go for it.